it was giving big baddie energy this is gonna bang this is gonna bang it was giving very much like take your package got them i look like a baddie in this i look like a baddie in this i already So welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Anita and on this channel we talk about fashion travel lifestyle and everything in between so get comfortable so honeys this is gonna be another haul video and I know 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 I say I'm gonna shop last listen guys from what I can tell you guys enjoy the video the hauls and I enjoy doing the hauls so why can't we just you know <laughs> Anyways, this haul is going to be a slightly different haul and it's because it's going to be an accessory haul. Yes, I love my accessories as you guys can see. This is a little bit demure for me. I like my chains, my rings. If you know me, you know this. But um, I got a couple items that I am crazy about that I really want to share with you guys. So if you haven't got your tea, your coffee, your wine yet, do that and let's get into it. All right, so the first brand that I shop from is Fumi De Label, and this is by my girl Fumi of Fumi Toronto as she's known on Instagram and guys I've been trying to shop Fumi for a while and you know what I'm gonna go back and get another thing but let's 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 refocus let's refocus I got this cute set of earrings from Fumi De Label, and guys I stalked this for a long time before I got it because I'm an earring person and they are just so cute and so big and I just felt like they would make the perfect statement earrings and that is why I grabbed them it's just jumbo earrings and I just feel like they're so so cute I love to wear a lot of gold and when I do wear some jewelry sometime because I my style is kind of simple I like pieces like this because they accentuate the look they make the look look a little bit more extra a little bit more out there a little bit more bold you know and I feel like this earrings are just perfect for that um, packaging 10 over 10 I love a good packaging she did a great job with the packaging I love it um, also the quality of the earrings is great they're not too heavy they're just really cute and they're just like a nice statement piece like it when I have my hair out this is gonna bang this is gonna be bad. So I think they're really cute and like I said, I'm gonna go pick up another piece from the website because I'm like, if I love this so much, the other ones are bigger, why not go bigger? So yeah, these are, just, these are really, really cute. I'm gonna put a link below for you guys to check it out. They also come in silver, but you guys know me. I only have like four things in silver and I have no interest. But yeah, this is the first item. All right, so the next place I shot from was Desi, and this is Desi Peckins line, and this is also another place that I've been looking to shop for for a while. So I tend to like some people and like their brands and want to support, but before I do, I make sure to do some research to make sure that what I'm buying actually makes sense for my collection, and I'm not just buying things because you guys know I'm trying to downsize. I'm trying to downsize to only own have things that make sense. So that was what I was trying to do. So I got two items from Desi and there are two pair of sunglasses and before I show you guys what they are I want to talk about the packaging Desi gets it I say this all the time I'm a packaging person I like my things to look cute and also you know make sense so it was really nice when I got this and I saw the packaging uh, the way it comes it comes in an outer shell like this that's kind of like a paper one and then on the inside we have this which is more like a it's like a soft leather but i don't think it's real leather and then when you open it up you have your sunglasses and then when you lift it up there is also a sunglass like protector case thingy so that's how it comes i think it's really cute uh, it's not a lot of detailing which i love you guys know i'm a beige girl i'm a nude girl i'm a neutral girl so this is gonna go really well in my apartment if i did want to do something with it so let us get into what i actually got and why i got them the first pair of sunglasses i picked up from desi are these 2000 glasses and this is in gold or g15 gradient i got this because it's giving very much 2000s it's giving true back like they did not lie it's giving what it was supposed to give but i mostly picked this up because i wanted something that was going to be a bit more versatile in my collection that i could wear with a bunch of things and also i just feel like the frame is really cute i love that it's not a hard frame that it's like a transparent frame so it just means that it would go with a lot more things 
plus I look like a baddie in this I look like a baddie in this I already wore this in my last vlog and if you check my community I put a lot of posts there I put some selfies sometimes and I already posted a selfie in this and it was giving baddie it was giving big baddie energy I love it it feels really good it doesn't feel flimsy or cheap and now I have a versatile piece in my collection that is not a black or a white or a pink or a gray or other colors <laughs> so the second pair I picked up are these backtrack sunglasses and these are in amber or honey and guys this is so cute so I got this because I already have my black and my bra on my white and I wanted a brown you know I wanted something like kind of brown you know, kind of tan but not too dark and this was just perfect I really love this because the frame and the um what are these things called? I don't know. But this and this are the same shade. Because <laughs> I was kind of nervous about the fit because I have a small head, especially when my hair is out, and I didn't know if it was gonna fit nicely on my head, but it fits so good. If you watch my latest reel, this is the sunglasses I actually wore in it. And I just thought it was really, really cute. Love the fit. I also love the quality of this, like it doesn't feel cheap, like there's a there's some weight there's some weight to this there is some weight to this and i just think it's really cool i feel like a baddie when i wear this i feel like i'm that girl because i am and the sunglasses confirm that but yeah this is really cute um now my collection is getting a lot more versatile so this is what i'm gonna wear when i actually want to go like really really like brown and earthy like that's my vibe but yeah a great add to my collection All right, so the next brand I shopped from was Tory Budge. I got two braces from Tory Budge. Um, I've actually had my eyes on these guys for a long time, and I wasn't sure if I really wanted them. But this summer, I wanted to get a new set of bracelets that I could stack together and create like a new, like mini quick stack. So this came in handy. I was deciding between these guys and the Hermes click H bracelet so I went with these guys because the Hermes click H bracelet is really cute but I wanted it in a black which would be the most diverse color because you guys know it's colorful however I figured even though a black is more diverse I still wouldn't get a lot of use from it the same way I would an all gold piece so this just actually made sense for me but let us get into each item on why I chose that so the first bracelet I picked up was the Miller stud hinge bracelet and I got this in a hold on let me check I got this in a medium um, and this is in the shade Tory gold and I got this because I wanted something that I could create like a really clean stack with if I was doing a, like an all gold look which is what I'm always almost always doing I will me that this is a replica of the um, Cartier bracelets we know this it's been around for a long time and it's always been known that it's been a rec replica and the Cartier bracelet is actually on my list for items to get when I hit a certain goal so I figured why not practice why not practice um, I think it's really cute the quality is pretty good it is um, fashion jewelry so obviously don't shower in this and expect it to last forever <laughs> i also like that it's like a click bracelet because i wear really long nails and sometimes there's nobody in the house to be you know putting things together for me so bracelets that i can just put on click on and be out the door work really lovely for me this was a nice buy i don't regret it it really fits really well and it's easy to put on but okay i didn't say this earlier Tur -Budge packaging so i don't know if it's because i'm in canada right now but the packaging was not given you know it was given very much you know it was given very much like take your package goddamn it was not given like i'm excited to open this up it was just it came in like one of those like tablet packets i don't know but it wasn't a cute packaging i'm just gonna say that yeah but anyways, let me show you guys the other bracelets. The next item I picked up from Tory Budge was the Kira Hinged Cuff in OS size. 
and guys even though what made me go on tour but was the other bracelet i actually really like this one a lot more i feel like it's just very chic and it's just very cute um i tend to wear this one on its own unless when i'm being extra then i add it to the stack here but i just prefer it on its own because although it's very simple the logo on here just makes it very very you know chic which i really like so it's typically what goes on my other hand on this hand when i'm trying to like balance it out a little bit but it's cute also fashion jewelry um so definitely don't shower with this i think this is gonna be a cute gift to get for someone you care about like your mom or your sister if you wanted to get them something this is actually really cute they could get a lot of wear from this because of how simple and elegant it is so definitely recommend this one this is like my fave which is crazy because i went for the other one but yeah sometimes you just fall in love with things and that just happens <laughs> so guys my hair is doing something i don't know it keeps bumping up in the side and i keep trying to put it down but it's not working so if you see it just know that i'm trying my best to keep everything together but things just keep moving okay but the last item that i picked up is so cute guys it's so cute it is from vestier collective let me show you guys <laughs> guys let me just let me tell you guys about this item so i have been on a bracelet hunt all summer and when i was trying to shop i was trying to decide between a couple items so the click h bracelet was on there the tour bush bracelet was on there um i don't know there were a couple other bracelets on there and i was like okay should i get them should i get them should i get them and then i came across this piece and it is a vintage chanel bracelet and i was like oh my god i think i'm in love i think i'm in love like i literally saw it the first day and bid it on it the first day like there was no let me go back and think about it there was none of that it was literally love at first sight and i have to have this and it was so amazing that they accepted my offer because i was like hi after bidding i dm them i was like hi can i really have this like please 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 let me have this and she was like oh okay sure i don't think she's ever received a message from someone really to have something so bad but yeah let me sh let me stop talking about it and actually show you guys what it is because I have been babbling and haven't shared it so let's go um so this is a 2003 rhinestone embellishment bracelet from Chanel it is it's 2003 vintage I think it is because I think it has to be over 25 or 15 years I don't know but it's old <laughs> and I haven't seen a lot of people wear this but guys, it is so cute it's really really cute I feel like it's the perfect addition to my stack so when I'm building my stack right now I just have my simple bracelet my hinge cuff from Tory Burch and then I have my Chanel bracelet and I just think it just makes a perfect summer stack like it is just too cute and before I got this I was a bit nervous about the size because it is pretty short but I went ahead and measured my wrist because the seller actually put a photo of the bracelet measured and she was like okay this is I think 19 centimeter 19 I think I don't know but I measured my wrist and it made sense and it was perfect and then when it came and I put it on and it was I was just like ah! <laughs> this is amazing guys it is so cute once again I don't have to tell you guys how versatile this is I think it's versatile I think it is um I think it elevates the look a little bit too because of the stones in it um also it comes authenticated so i know that it's real chanel thanks to this year this is what made my summer i, I kind of wish i waited to get it towards my birthday so i could be like oh this is my birthday gift for myself but i had to get it when i saw it because i knew that if i let this go someone else is gonna have it and i wouldn't have it so now but yeah guys this is the last item i picked up um shout out to vestir i've been shopping there a lot lately especially for luxury items sometimes you don't want to pay the full price sometimes you can get it slightly cheaper and that's okay by me do that but yeah honeys that is the last of it i hope you guys enjoyed it this is a shorter video today i know i know it wasn't the intention um this week just got really really busy but if you guys watch my vlog you know what's been happening you know what i'm prepping for you know why life is so crazy but yeah honeys that's all i have for you today i hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure to like comment and subscribe and turn on your post notifications because i'm gonna be back on your screen 
pretty soon with more exciting content and september is around the corner which is my birthday which is fashion week which is a lot so get excited and yeah i'll see you guys next week bye honeys <laughs>